there is one way of PKing in RuneScape which is very common in PvP worlds, and that is to simply wait at teleportation spots for players to teleport in. However, waiting at these teleport locations put myself at risk of getting PK'd. So how could I possibly scout these locations without being there myself? It is very simple. Let me introduce to you the scrying pool. With a construction level of 80, you can make yourself a scrying pool which allows you to look at the location without being there. This is Varrock, Falador, Canifis, Anacarn, Lunar Island, and many many more. And this scrying pool is the method we are going to use today to hunt players in RuneScape. But there is one thing you should know about the scrying pool. If you stare into it long enough, a wise old man is going to spawn with a secret message. This video is sponsored by Filmora. The wise old man has blessed us with Filmora 9, a great video editing software. So if you have ever thought about making videos, then this is the perfect opportunity for you. Filmora has a library full of great transitions, titles and effects that I have never seen before. Something I love using while editing is the green screen, and Filmora's tool for it works fantastic. Who knows, maybe you watching right now will be one of RuneScape's next Golden Gnome winner. So if you're interested, there is a download link for the trial version in the description down below. Something I'm consistently going to do in this episode when I get the chance is to log in under people waiting at a teleport spot and just spec them out with 1 HP Darok and hope we get the RNG to kill them. The AFK? No! 7 to 8! Okay, I've scouted this guy. You want drugs, guy. Come on, stay there, stay right there. Okay, standing on this tile. World 43. Here we go. Good luck to me. Oh my god! Did you get him? Oh my god. Dragon Claws! Oh, <laughs> no way. Full Dragon Eye! <laughs> Holy crap! And he didn't even screen share, what the hell? Typical. Yeah. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Run, 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 run. Let's log out. Holy shit! I think I left, I think I left something on the ground. 85 fucking mil. Yep, in the process of looting, I did actually leave items worth 7 mil on the ground. But we still made 85 mil, so I'm very happy with that. I found a guy in the tent. Let's go for the Gmail here. Come on! Gmail! Yes! It worked! Okay, we made like 100k, not even worth it. Level 26. I killed a level 26, I'm not sure what he is. What? 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 I think I just killed a bot. I just killed a bot for 1.3 mil. Me and my friend noticed how this guy was consistently putting dragon plate legs in the Falador powder room. So we waited for him to come back. Oh my god. Holy shit, little Willis. Damn, okay, let's have a price check. I picked up the wizard boots I missed out on, and then we got... So we PK'd a total of 1.8 mil. Nice. I've scouted at level 90. I just died to a recoil. I died to a tail block. What's this? There's someone just AFK here. Is this the spot? I think this is the spot. Here we go, here we go. He's been standing here for such a long time too. Oh! 79! Poor the KO. Toxic staff! Oh my god. Oh my god. Tome of fire. Smoke runes. There's so much loot on the ground. Uh oh. PK here. Wow! 11 mil PK? What? Holy! This, this idea is working so good! This is such a great idea! I'm so good! I died to a D skim. Oh. 
Oh, we got a kill. Full elders. Oh my god. Chaos runes. That's a lot of teleports. Hello. Sears ring. Beautiful coins. Thanks to the scrying portal, we got a level 22 hunting hard requirements. And we managed to PK him for 906k. Thank you very much. What? I got frozen in my scrying portal. What? Do you guys see that? That was so weird. There's a dragon harpoon in world 43. He doesn't know he's losing the dragon harpoon. Is this a free dragon harpoon? How much are they? Aren't they like 5 mil? Wait. A free dragon harpoon, baby. Fi oh, it's only 500k. He's AFK. Just died. He just died. This is my third attempt on this guy. He is gold. Oh my god! Holy shit! The G mob came in clutch there. All right, I think this is everything. It's only 645k. I thought it was more. What the hell is this? I mean, 300k for free. Demon feet. Uh, I'll take it. What did I just run into? What? Occult? That's a free 600k! So I spotted this man teleporting into Falador and my first instinct based on his weapon, he was on a farm run. I mean, he must have went to the Draenor patch. Hurry up, hurry up. He was here. Oh, we got him. I can't believe we found him. Runner seeds, watermelon seeds, 567, limp root seed, 1000, snake grass, 98, runner seeds, 8, runner weed, 435k. Thank you very much. Scrying pool gives results here. <laughs> but I haven't gotten a single kill in like 3 hours. I do have one problem with scrying pools, and that's the fact that I only have X amount of scrying locations to look at. And for this reason, I decided to make something I'd like to call the Flying Scrying Pool. That's basically a scout, but it doesn't really look like a scout. I dressed up an account to look like a hardcore man hunter. So the PKers wouldn't suspect anything from this account. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see if it works. And we got the kill. Verax Blade Skirt, beautiful. And I've been TB'd. Bye. We got one of the dual arena cappers for 1.2 mil. My flying scrying pool brought me here to the Shantae Pass. And at this very moment, a lore was going down. If you look right here, there's an account ready to spec the guy getting lured out for all his items. So I decided to log in under him and try to kill him. Quick phrase on. I almost PK'd the lurer for Dragon Claws. But that's not where the clip ends. The guy getting lured stepped outside of the safe zone and my first instinct was to kill him. Oh, I got him. Oh my god. The guy got lord. 58 mil! Oh my god. After reflecting over what just happened, I felt bad about keeping this 58 mil. So I tried looking for this guy at Lumbridge, couldn't find him. I tried adding him, his private was off. So if you're the guy who got lured, if you see this, let me know and I'll give you back your stuff because I feel very bad keeping this money. But on a positive note, the lures did not get this money. My friend scouted at 78 in RD so I just had to go for him.
got him. <laughs> Woo! Oh shit, that's a lot. Oh my god, look at this. Let's see, how much is this? The BP kit 4.8 mil from that. Something I've noticed for the past two weeks, there have been a heavy increase of hardcore IM and hunters. And if we focus on the rangers, they usually risk a dark bow while only having 10 HP. So if you find them, it's pretty much a free dark bow. Yep, he's dead. Is that a free dark bow? That is a free... Oh my god, that's a lot of teleports. We're going to end the video on that note. We had a lot of nice kills in this episode, but we also had a lot of failed attempts and a lot of deaths. But in general, we made profit, and if you did enjoy this one, I would gladly accept your like on the video. A subscription to the channel would be gladly appreciated. And I got something special waiting for you very, very soon.